It's a tragedy what's happened. Can you tell us about the meal that you cooked? I'm so devastated by what's happened, by the loss of Don and Don is still in hospital, the loss of Ian and Heather and Gail. They were some of the best people that I've ever met. Gail was like. Take your time. <laughs> Gail was the mum that I didn't have because my mum passed away four years ago. And Gail's never been anything but good and kind to me. And Ian and Heather were some of the best people I've ever met. They never did anything wrong to me. I'm so devastated about what's happened. Can you tell and us And the loss to the community mm. and to the families and to my own children who've lost their grandmother. Can, t can you tell us a bit more about the lunch? What I can tell you is that I just can't fathom what has happened. I just can't fathom what has happened. That Ian and Heather have lost their lives and Gail has lost her life and Donna's still in hospital and I pray, I pray that he pulls through because my children love him. And you must be pretty shaken up by this as well. I'm devastated. I love them. And I can't believe that this has happened and I'm so sorry that they have lost their lives. How are you but I just stuff? can't believe it. I just can't believe it. Can you tell us where the mushrooms came from? Police say you're a suspect. Do you have anything to say about yes, that? Yes, I say I didn't do anything. I love them and I'm devastated that they're gone. And I hope that with every fibre of my being that Don pulls through. That's where what I have to say. Where did the come from? Were they picked by you or where did they come from, Mary? Can you tell us? What meal did you cook them? Did you eat the same meal, Mary? 